I first met Melissa my either my sophomore or my junior year of college. A uh, hunger friend actually came over to my apartment to play a poker game. Uh, as the night progressed, we got to know each other a little better and found out that we had a lot in common and we shared a lot of the same interests. And I guess our relationship just grew from there. The timing wasn't quite right then, but as God knows, the timing was going to be a little bit down the road. Some of the most significant memories that I have of Bobby incorporate my family. So, you know, it really means a lot to me that my mom was able to meet Bobby and not only meet him, but actually advocate for him. Uh, so much to the fact that she would try to convince me to be with him and she would try to tell me to give him a chance. At the time, I just wasn't ready. I think, you know, I was afraid of love for most of my life. and. I knew I was going to fall madly in love with him. I already had deep emotional connections to him. When the night has come and the land is dark and the moon is the only light we'll see. No, I won't be afraid. Oh, I won't be afraid just as long as you stand. Stand by me So darling, darling Stand by me Oh, stand by me Oh, stand now Stand by me Stand by me If the sky that we look upon Should tumble and should crumble to the sea. I won't cry, I won't cry, no, I won't shed a tear just as long as you stay, stand by. gathered here in the presence of God, surrounded by the beauty of his creation, and nurtured by the sights and sounds of nature to celebrate the wedding of Melissa Luxury. Love is the condition in which the happiness of another person is essential to your own. If you want something to last forever, you treat it differently. You shield it, you protect it, you don't expose it to the elements, you don't make it common or ordinary. If it ever becomes tarnished, you lovingly polish it until it gleams like new. It becomes special because you have made it so. And love grows more beautiful and precious as time goes by.
usually you don't shoot them. Your favorite. <laughs> All kidding aside, I really do love the both of you, and I'm so happy you're joining our family. So if everyone could raise their glass and help me toast the newlyweds. 